What's up, YouTube? It's Mr. Dark Shadow 101 here, and today I'm gonna show you how to make a liquid chrome invisible effect in Sony Vegas Pro. All right, let's get started. First thing you wanna do is get your footage and drag it in. I'm gonna delete my audio because I don't need it, and I'm gonna delete the footage that I don't need in my clip. Just click the S key split it and right click and delete to take it away now just deleting my footage that I don't need there we go now what you want to do is look for a background scene that you want you can just take a video clip of what it is behind your liquid effect or just get in any other scene that you want I'm just gonna use any other scene Right there we go. Now what you want to do is go to video event pen crop, click the mask, make sure it's checked, and go to your anchor creation tool and mask around um, the part that you want to be affected. Just gonna try to do a fast mask because I don't want it to take too long, but it's gonna take a different amount of time depending on how good you want it. Now you're going to put feather type, I think out, yeah, out looks the best. And you're going to put it, I think, either three or four, whichever one is best for you guys. But I would, I use four. Now you're going to go to your compositing mode and click custom. And go to Sony height map. Now you're going to click both of these inverse source data and alpha channel scales. And the smooth is you're going to bring it down a bit. To about five or six. I would use four. Now you're gonna um, change this to wrap pixels around. And over here in the hot on uh, the height mo modifiers, um, I'll just mess around with it to see how well you want it. Just however you want. It's pretty much wherever you want. And the source channel stays as intensity. And well, this is how it would look. Alright guys, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Bye.